हरे कृष्णा लाइफ में नॉकअस डाउन बट इट कांट कीपर्स डाउन सपोज वी आर वॉकिंग अलॉन्ग द रोड एंड सम हेफ्टी पर्सन कम्स एंड पुशेज अस वी फॉल डाउन ना वेन दिस हैपन्स इफ दैट पर्सन जस्ट वॉक्स अवे देन वी हैव द ऑप्शन टू गेट अप एंड मूव ऑन so similarly during the journey of our life certain events will happen which will knock us down even in our spiritual journey when we are trying to live a upright life at that time certain yeah, certain lapses may happen we may fall down now when these happen we the force of that situation or the force of the temptation may knock us flat but it can't keep us flat the nature of this world is that nothing is permanent even adversities are not permanent and even uh, pleasures that may tempt us they are also not permanent so in the bhagavad gita krishna urges us to tolerate difficulties by contemplating their temporariness he says in 2.14 matra sparshas tu kaunteya शीतोष्ण सुख दुखदाह आगम आपाई नो नित्यस ताम स्थितिक्ष स्वभारत ही सेस दैट मात्रा स्पर्श दैट यू आर सो अ सोल अर्जुन एंड यू हैव अ बॉडी एंड दैट बॉडी विल कम इन कॉन्टैक्ट विद एक्सटर्नल ऑब्जेक्ट्स एंड दैट कॉन्टैक्ट बिटवीन द बॉडी एंड एक्सटर्नल ऑब्जेक्ट्स मात्रा स्पर्श विल समटाइम्स लीड टू हैपीनेस एंड समटाइम्स टू डिस्ट्रेस शीत उष्ण जस्ट है समटाइम्स इट्स वॉर्म एंड समटाइम्स इट्स समटाइम्स इट्स हॉट एंड समटाइम्स इट्स कोल्ड समटाइम्स सिमिलरली देर बी हैपीनेस एंड समटाइम्स इज स्ट्रेस इज इज आगम आ पाई नो अनित्यस दैट देर इज बिगिनिंग देर इज अ एंड एंड देर टेम्पररी ताम स्थिति स्वभारत देर फोर टॉलरेट दैम टॉलरेट दैम हाउ टॉलरेट दैम बिकॉज दिल कम एंड दे विल गो so just like if we are in a place where a, a, the winter comes it's difficult but it will go the season will change it will be warm afterwards so we need to focus on our higher purpose so, so when we are, when we are knocked down either by distresses or by desires rather than thinking that our success is in resisting that particular desire or our success is in avoiding that particular distress we should say that our success is it per is in acting its spiritual integrity in uh, living according to dharma and dharma means that even if we fall we rise and that vision to rise comes when we see beyond the material situations to the spiritual reality to our eternally benevolent lord when our vision rises towards krishna and krishna's love for us and the ever present opportunity to love and serve him then we can rise at the start of the bhagavad gita arjuna had put aside his bow saying i can't fight but by the end of the bhagavad gita he picked up his bow in readiness to fight similarly life may knock us down and we may put aside our metaphorical bow saying i can't fight but if we persevere in the practice of bhakti then we will raise our bow we will again rise and ultimately by focusing our vision not on the life's blows but on the lord who can help us to resist the life's blows and who can help us recover from life's blows focusing our vision on him we can rise and march till we go beyond this life with all its blows to an eternal life which will be filled with joy thank you hari krishna